Stadium in Foxborough. As we'll see Cam Newton and the New England Patriots versus Josh Allen and the Buffalo Bills. The performance like that. Agreed. Right back to Singletary on second down. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. For a lot of people, he, uh, they're going to have to look his way more than once when giving out this award this season, I think. Yeah, it's not just the consistency. It's been some plays that we've seen where we talk about it for weeks thereafter. That's what we're, When they're that high power, you've got to find a way to hold them under 20 because, to me, that's the magic number. 20-point score gives yourself your, you give yourself your best chance to win. So if they're up around 24, 28, the bench, just to rest, how do you approach the rest of this regular season? I'm telling you, you don't ask the easy stuff, do you? I mean, you created a heck of a situation. And all the way home for a Bills touchdown. Stephon Diggs, 45 yards. And the Bills have taken the early lead. Not a bad way to start it. And I think that that was part of their script because so many teams script their opening possessions. And, and whether it's just that possession or even deeper into the half, sometimes it's 15 to 30 plays. That had to be one in there where they call the other side of the field. I'm doing everything. Every trick play I can think of, every different formation, you name it, I'm throwing it at him. But he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. A big gain there for the Bills. So they fake the handoff. Now Allen. And he's got his man here, Beasley. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. And a good quarterback facing zone coverage. If he has just a little bit of time to survey the scene, that's what's going to happen. No doubt about it. If there's no pressure, he's going to continue to pick them apart because he'll have all that time to find someone. Carolina did that against Denver. They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with an interception. And he is into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Devin Singletary. A 12-yard touchdown run, and the Bills will extend their lead. A strong, determined run there, Charles, to get in for six points. This is why it's such a team game, isn't it? And I know that sounds really generic. Come up second and six now from the 24. Allen going to throw. The left side caught by Diggs. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. A big game. Not resting on his laurels. He's trying to continue to gain as many yards as possible and continue this big season. Well, here's second and eight. Throwing now is Allen. The Sanders has got it complete. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the 30. That reception, it brings him up to the 700 plateau. He's at 700 career NFL catches now. And that club in baseball, or that either. They'll run on first down with Singletary. And he'll be a couple yards shy. Of and a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage. So far today, he's got one, but was denied as he tried to get the second. He will find Diggs in the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. <laughs> Stephon Diggs with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Bills will add on to their lead. So simple math here in the first half. They've had three drives offensively, and they have scored every time, and they've got the lead. Well, whenever we talk about adjustments, we usually talk about it out of the end zone. He's trying to get a second touchdown already in the first half. They had that one earlier. was bidding for a second. And he'll get in. Touchdown, Buffalo. Devin Singletary with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Bills continue to pull away here in this first half.
If you did know it, it won't surprise you to find out that this team leads the league in scoring. They've been a quick strike team all season long. There's another example. They did it again. This offensive coordinator, right now you can write his ticket towards being ahead. First down, and they're going to throw with Allen. Going deep for Diggs. It's caught inside the 25. And he's in for the touchdown on the final play of the first half. The prayer is answered. How did they get that done? First and 10. This is a draw play. Allen gives to Singletary. A strong running. <laughs> And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before. On first down, Singletary. They find some open field here. Pass the 20. And finally out of bounds inside the five at the four. A big play here for Buffalo. Stay with it, doesn't it? Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit them, but now they got to get ready. It's first, and he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Turnover on downs, the most recent example, and now, obviously, they're in a great spot here. Yeah, if you're over on the bench right now, you're shaking hands with your teammate, you're hugging him, give him a little... Well, this is taken in. It's complete. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. A big game there for the Bills. Charles, you said earlier this defense is probably going to need to hold these guys right around 20 or under that if they were going to have a chance. It was evident pretty early on that wasn't. seen this a bunch of times as well. The defense can crowd the line of scrimmage. If you just hand it off inside, you're getting your running back popped a lot as well. Sometimes the defense dictates it. If they're going to crowd it, you may have no other choice but to throw it downfield. For here, Charles, the lead in the fourth quarter. This is when coaches that have a reliable running game, they breathe a little easier on the sideline. Yeah, they love the idea that they can take the air out of the football at this point of the game. That means they can't score. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And they are going to score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their totals. And for them, this train, it just keeps rolling, doesn't it? Well on their way to yet another victory. Yeah, it's almost a runaway, isn't it? And you just wonder how anyone <laughs> could stop this. they got full momentum going, full confidence going. But it's not just their own confidence that is leading them. It's the lack of confidence against their opponents now. So yet another victory as they hope to polish it off here in quarter number four. And Allen is actually going to throw it here. He's got the hookup with Diggs. And out across midfield, down to the 45. Sometimes you find the defense vulnerable, so they went for the bigger shot, went for it all on that one. This time, they were ready for it. And he'll get this one down near the Probably only matter to the statisticians as this ball game is now officially over. A big offensive explosion helped leading them to victory. And the defensive guys, they're just saying, hey, put those points up every week. We'll just keep winning. They will gratefully accept them, won't they? It makes their job that much easier when they're scoring that many points. Allows them to play with a totally different style and a different flow. So for Buffalo, they are now two wins away from a perfect regular season as they move to 15-0. And they'll head back.